sir, we have now uh, Arputa. Uh, he's from France. Uh, Arputa, please, uh, you can unmute yourself and uh, you can share your experiences, Arputa. Hello? Am I audible? Yes, yes, Arputa, you are audible. Yes, Namaskaram, Patriji. Um, my name is Arputa Infant, and I am from Tamil. I thought Arpita is a lady. Arpita, we cannot hear you. One, can you just, yeah, can go ahead. Can. Meeting again and again, I don't know why. Okay. Now we can hear you. Now it's okay? Yes, it's okay, Arpita. Okay, uh, sorry for this. And Namaskaram Patriji, my name is Arpita Infant, and I am 26 years old. And uh, I was born in Tamil Nadu uh, in a small city called Dindikal. Uh, and then I was brought up over there. And then I went to Chennai to do my engineering in mechanical. And after doing my bachelor degree, I got an opportunity to do my master's in France. And then I came in the year of 2016 to France. And then after two years of my studies, I completed finishing the studies. And then I started working here in an automobile company. Uh, from my, uh, I was always like, feeling like once once I came to France, I I was started uh, seeing the difference between how they how work here and how we were working in India. Not like big differences, like why uh, people are rich here and why Indians are, we are poor there. Not like, but even the small things like why people are uh, talking. Here, if we take the French people, they talk very slowly. And uh, in India, we, we have the tendency to always talk very loudly. And I was asking why this is all happening. And from me, I, I am getting response as well. Like, because in the old days, as the country is very, it has cold climate, because of that, the people, they were always uh, in their house. And this situation made them to uh talk in very uh, lighter manner but whereas in india as it the temperature is always humid and hot the people has the tendency to let the windows and everything open so that they, they uh, the air will be there and then there has to be very loud enough so that it can reach many people so you know these are the differences that i am seeing in my life and then i am keep uh, posing the questions like uh, this uh, difference, like it, uh, thing, like why there is a difference in med medicine system in India. Uh, most of the people, more than fifty percentage of the population, are affected by diabetes. Whereas here in France, uh, diabetes can be curable. But whereas we in India, we have to consume medicine for a long time, and uh, I saw that. I was keep on seeing many videos and then I was started being against to the modern medicine, what they are following. And then I was started reading many Tamil ancient texts like Tirkural and then uh, uh, Tirumandiram written by Tirumular, for example. And these uh, texts are giving me knowledge that how we people, without having any uh, scientific technology, at the time we started. We, pre we are not we are saying that in this universe there are n number of galaxies and then there are many planets uh, and then what we are uh, here is uh, are around nine planets are there the people are so, uh, talking this uh, many centuries before even in but only in recent times uh, the modern uh, field discovered that the earth is uh, not flat but it is round so uh, slowly, I was uh, started seeing the videos of Sadhguru, for example, and then Osho, uh, all these um, spiritual leaders, uh, the words were speaking to me. And then, uh, okay, everything is okay. I want to know more about what is life. So how to find out? The, uh, actually, I, I can understand. I am not my body. I am not my mind as well. So what is real me? How can I find that? So Osho is telling that there are 112 techniques of meditation you can do so you can 
find who you were. But okay, so I got the book. Uh, the book name is The Book of Secret, written by Otto. And then I was reading it, but I did not know. I, I the first nine meditation techniques are uh, involved using the technique, and then he he has many other techniques. But I was practicing daily, little by little. But I, I did not know the very uh, concrete one for me. And then, so when it was happening like that, uh, uh, Buddha was came into my life. I started his life. How it has happened to him. And then, uh, and I, during this lockdown period in Corona, especially, I finished reading and seeing uh, many videos about Buddha. And afterwards, um, I, uh, I was born in a Christian family, so I was not at all aware of Buddhism, Hinduism, everything. And all these things are touch, are started touching me. But once I have um, the knowledge about this, no medicine and uh, um, we can have a healthy life, as written in Tirukural, like uh, in Tirukural, he used to say that if we uh, consume the food, what based on our needs, and we digest and we send it everything, and only after sending the waste from our body, only then if we start to consume, we will have no diseases at all in our body. So Tirukural was saying like, and when I and when I happen to see the video of you talking the same like Tiruvalluvar is explaining and then uh, you are giving a simple technique of meditation like just observe your breath and that is what the meditation and uh, so I thought that this has to be something which is following me and then I started meditating it's been nearly eight months that I am doing meditation right from the month of uh, September in the last year and I started doing 40 minutes in the morning and 30 minutes in the evening, and then I increased to one hour in the morning and two hours in the evening. But I don't say that I'm meditating. Yes, I am thinking whenever I meditate, but I know that this is the path. It will happen like that. Slowly, I can go into the meditation uh, field. But th what this meditation has brought in my life is it has not brought me something extraordinary, something. Uh, I, uh, Mirac miraculous, but it has made it, it has started making me to feel everything that is happening around me is miracle, and I am happy simply of no reason. Meditation is like uh, having a bath, like we are having a bath to uh, pure our body every, every day, and meditation is helping me to change my mind so that I can work efficiently. Instead of thinking, I am working, instead of thinking, uh, what can I do? What can I eat for my lunch? Uh, what can I prepare for the dinner for this night? I am not at all thinking of that. When I work, I only work. So this is what meditation is for me, I guess. I, that's what I experienced so far. And uh, I would like to continue in the same uh, feel and you are my great inspiration, Patriji sir. Because of you, I started reading many books. I finished Yogi uh, autobiography of Yogi, and then uh, many uh, books are written by Osho. And also, I started learning Gita uh, because I would like to in the future. I would like to organize meditation, so I started also practicing Gita. So yeah. That's what I would like to share. I know I have no things. I would just like to share the experience. You are a perfect master. Thank you so much, Patriji. <laughs> a great word. You will go a long way in helping the whole world. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. I am so happy, Patriji, for your wonderful words. Only intelligent people can understand meditation. Yes. It requires intelligence, basic common sense, basic intelligence to understand meditation. Those people who don't have basic intelligence, my own elder brother, who is a PhD in mechanical engineering, who is no more now, but he, he could never understand meditation because he was he was not 
writing brain. He was a PhD in meditation, in mechanical engineering from Manchester. But he, but he was against meditation. My own elder brother. He never listened to me. But whether all you people are listening to me. So those people who listen to meditation, they are the really intelligent people. My elder brother, who was a PhD, in, he was a stupid fellow. And I am very, very happy to see you intelligent. It's my pleasure, Pati. Because of you, not because of you. Because of everything around me. <laughs> because of your own intelligence, you have become a master. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Pati. And, and I, 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 I only give my information to you, that's all, which you have used with your intelligence. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Please, Please continue. I, I know you will continue with your great sure. for truth. I'm happy that you have mentioned Tiruvalluvar, Tirumandiram, Tirumular, all those great masters. Yes, Patsiji. And uh, also Vallalar, I was I I forgot to mention Vallalar. Yes, uh, yes. He was the great master who uh, who was uh, who insisted everybody to become vegetarians. And yes, this yes. was also the fact why I started following you because many masters they know uh, what will happen if we take non-vegetarian food. But in the starting, uh, they won't say this to many people because many people they start follow them so this was the drawback i found in many other leaders but others you are open you you hit in nothing you are open so that's what i need i need I, many people are needy uh, many people in the world they need this truth because truths are there but they are hidden uh, not hidden but it is not spoken at all we have to start to speak so that this information can pass to many other people because we are we are seeing animals as if the product that we can eat. Before, before I was non-vegetarian, but once I came into this meditation, uh, even before med coming to medicine, after reading many uh, books written by Vallalar, uh, I was slowly be, be leaving uh, eating non-vegetarians. But once started doing medicine. The craving it went just uh, you know in uh, just like that. Uh, I don't know how it happened. It just magic. And also, I I I spoke many uh, many things about uh, meditation and the yoga thing up to my parents. And my father he started meditating. Now every day in the morning meditates one hour, and then he also became vegetarian. So I changed my father and. Next, I think hopefully my mom and then everybody will start to change. We have to change first of all so that I mean, the other things can happen afterwards. And then I also I bought uh, pyramids. I ordered pyramid. Yeah, I was meditating under the pyramid. And then now I uh, got pyramid cap as well. So thank you so much for your wisdom you gave us. And I hope uh, we uh, as your followers, we will use them wisely and then uh, we will provide to this entire humanity and to every creature in the planet and the universe to make use of your wisdom wisely. Romba, Romba, Nandri. <laughs> Romba, Nandri, Thank you. For coming into my life and allowing me to come into your life. Thank you. Thank you so much, Arputa. Thank, Thank you so much. much. Thank you. Yes, that was wonderful. Thank you, Patricia.